<laughs> Hello, my brothers and sisters of the Order, and welcome back to Horror October. And today, we are talking about Lila Rona. The tale of Lila Rona mainly begins as it follows. A beautiful young woman in Mexico, and a witch who falls in love with a wealthy man. It is said the man who sways her into falling in love with him, and in such, they join out of wedlock. The woman gives birth to two children, and in such, is happy with her husband and family. But then it is said that the man starts to leave her for a wealthy younger woman. Some of the tales even say that the man threatened to even take the children away. Upon hearing all of this, it said that the woman would be enraged and kills her children, either by drowning them, throwing them from a cliff, or even burning them in her home, only to then come to her senses when she realizes of what she had done. She is then stated to have actually taken her own life in order to reunite with her children. But since she had committed the ultimate sins of murder and suicide, she is forever cursed by God to search in vain for her children. She is known to be heard to be crying out for her children, wearing a white dress and veil, crying and weeping, begging and asking where are her boys. It is said that she can be heard throughout the region of Mexico and South America. Many times over, her screams and cries are heard far and wide. It is said that if a man is to be encountered by her, she would attack them, and in such, they would be left with a ghastly scar or choked, almost as though by an evil force, while women feel as though an evil hatred is upon them, and children are found dead, either by drowning or choked to death, we do not know, but there are many ways in which this creature of death is known to follow. This vengeful spirit, La Rona, the weeping woman, is a customary fear to all. It is said that the story actually is based in real form and history, mainly with a mixture of ancient Mexican and Spanish culture, mainly of Aztec and Mayan women, who of which were loved and adored in life and in such were actually known to be the heroes of which mankind could easily thrive, even in childbirth. However, when a woman was said to have died, they are extremely feared as a spirit, known to be seen in a white gown weeping, mainly because of their untimely death. Mainly, this can be seen because of the story of La Llorona. However, one of the major stories that ever takes place is that of which has been based in history, but none other than La Marici, who is actually said to have become a slave and even mistress of none other than Haran Cortez. She said she was stated to have borne his children, and as well soon lost him as they were sent to Spain for education. It is said that she forever wept in tears and mourning for the loss of her children. In fact, this story is actually based to explain the female's perspective, in which is a tale of warning to many children to not actually stay out after dark, and as well to many women to choose on who their husband should be, and to not make their mistake as the life of her own did. Beware her curse. Beware her cry. Never venture out after dark. Be mindful. Those who encounter Lai Lorona.